Hello guys, welcome to my channel Create Knowledge. Now I will tell you how to install Visual Studio Code in your system. So now first you have to go Google Chrome browser. Now you write here Visual Studio Code download. Now this is the official website of Visual Studio Code. Just click on it. Here three platforms are there, one for Windows, Linux and Mac. This window, it support for Windows 8, 10 and 11. I am just going to click on Windows. Now you see, it is downloading, downloading in my system. Now download it is completed. Just double click on this file. Now you see license agreement. It is asking for accept this license agreement. So I am going to accept it and then next. And it asking for create desktop icon. I am select it. Okay, then next. That is asking to install. Then I click on install. Now it is installed and you see this is the shortcut key of Visual Studio Code. It appear on my desktop. Then finish. Now you see this is the welcome page. I am going to close this welcome page. Now you see this is for file explorer. This is for search. This is for source control. This is for run debug and this is for extension. Now I will go for extension and I will go for code runner. Well, I have to select for code runner. And here you see code runner. Code runner is required because if you install this code runner, then you can write program in Java, C, C++, PHP, Python, and a lot of program is there. You can you can you can uh, write in this Visual Studio Code. So that's why I'm going for Code Runner. I'm going to install in my system. Okay, it is already installed my system. So again, I'm going to, I'm going to uninstall it, and again I'm going to install in my system. Now it is installing in my system. That is installed. Okay, then I close it and then I'll click on Explorer file. Now I'm going to open a folder. So I'll guess I'll going to open a folder in my D drive. Just I'm going to open a folder in my D drive. Just close it. I'm going to my D drive. In my D drive, I'll open a folder here. Project. Project. So whatever the program I write in uh, Visual Studio Code, all code will be stored in my VS Code project file. Uh, sorry, in my VS Code project folder. Now I'm going to open again VS Studio Code and open folder and I will select on my D drive VS Code project and select folder and open it. You see VS Code project is open. I close it. Here you can create a file here on VS Code, pro VS Code project and you can create a new folder also. Now I am going to create a file HTML file. Now I am writing here index.html. Then enter. Now 
you see index by HTML folder is created. For writing in a HTML file, you can just put exclamation sign and enter on press enter and you see a HTML, HTML template is open. So you need not to write anything else. You need not to write head, body, title. It is automatically, it has come, it is appearing in your HTML file. So here I am going to change the title document. I am just going to change this title. Now I am giving the title name. And in body, I am writing something. In H1 tag, I will write something. I am writing here. Thanks for watching my video. And please subscribe. So I am writing here. Now I am going to save this program. File, save. And I am going to run this program. So I am going to run. Set, start debugging. No problem. And it is asking which option you prefer. Now I am going for web app Chrome. See, you see the output is that what I have written a body in H1 tag. Thanks for watching my video and subscribe. Same output, I have, I have got the same output. So I think now you understand how to write a program in Visual Studio Code. So I am requesting you, please subscribe my channel. And also press the bell icon for my next video. Thanks a lot for watching my video. Please do subscribe. Thanks. Bye.